And we're back, guys. Welcome to Good Energy. We report on tenants. Good Energy reporting on tenants. The numbers can be deceiving, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. The numbers can be deceiving. Annette Conteve taking on Bonaventure. Bonaventure, the underdog against Jill Teichman. That was a lock. That's a, that's correct, ladies and gentlemen. A lock. Super duper lock. Jill Teichman, I gave out the lock against Laura Siegman, but Jill Teichman did not look good in that match. Taking on Bonaventure, both ladies are lefties, and the reality here is Bonaventure is approaching a 40-win season. Jill Teichman struggling, barely 500, and Bonaventure delivered. Annette Conteve is big time, so big time. She fought with Kanepi to get a tournament in her own hometown, and the fans are showing up, and Annette Conteve is showing out. However... As I said, the numbers are misleading. Annette Conteve taking the first set 6-3. Right now, we're on serve in the second set, and the numbers are dead even. That's correct. Both ladies, 70% first serves. Both ladies, 70% second serves. The difference maker in this match is just one break. There's only been one break opportunity. If Bonaventure can put together a good return game, she'll be right back in this match based on the numbers. If you look at the numbers. But nonetheless, Annette Conteve, look, she's a great indoor hard player. You remember that 23-match win streak? You thought uh, Iga Swiatek was big time. When we're talking about indoor hard, Annette Conteve is big time. And it's only right for her to have an indoor hard tournament in her home country. The fans are so loud, the air, the chair empire continuously is having to tell them to be quiet during play. Can Annette Conteve pull it off? She's facing a crafty lefty. These are the matches Annette has to win if she wants to get back to her old form. And the reality here is she's leading. She just has to close out the second set. So we head back to Estonia. Kia Kanepi Muchova's up next. That's going to be a tough match for Kanepi. We're going to see if Muchova's anywhere near her form a few years ago. I think she takes it. But Kanepi is playing very well. She just beat Ostapango. If she beat Ostapango, she could beat Muchova. If Muchova's in shape and form, she could beat Kanepi. We're going to see what happens.